Roughly half of all of Kent's waste is recycled these days. Pretty good. But what happens to the other half? Well, it gets turned into electricity, with just over 1% of waste having to go to landfill last year. Every council in Kent send their domestic waste here. Now that's 6,000 tonnes of waste every single week. Let's go and see how it works. This massive crane feeds the waste into the shredders and can lift up to six tonnes in one load. The waste to energy plant uses an environmentally friendly system. And that's constantly monitored by the team behind me, but also the Environment Agency to make sure that it's run safely and efficiently. So if you see clouds coming out the chimneys, you can be sure that it's steam and not smoke. But how does waste become electricity? Well, the waste, which is now essentially a fuel, feeds the three incinerators that are here. Now they get up to 650 degrees centigrade, and believe me, you can really feel the heat coming off of them now. Now this, in turn, heats the boilers, which produces steam. And the steam turns the turbines, which produce up to 45 megawatts of electricity per hour. That's enough electricity to supply homes in towns the size of Maidstone, Sevenoaks and Tunbridge. Once you've separated out all of your recyclable things and your compostable things from all the rest, you now know that what's left in your general waste is being used to make electricity instead of just going to landfill.